Hey everybody, you might recognize Tiff from a whole bunch of different videos from the Himalaya trip and the Salala trip and everything else. And um, now back in 2018, uh, I think it was June, we were both in Chicago and we took two Harleys uh, down Route 66 to Bloomington. And unfortunately, at the time, didn't have a GoPro. So we didn't film the ride. Yeah. Now we find ourselves in Orlando. And this time, we got an Insta360. And she's got a GoPro Max. So we're going to film this ride because we're picking up two bikes and we're going to have some fun. Yes. <laughs> yeah, we're going to have some fun. All right, uh, check this out. Day two, we are heading out to a popkill lake and we're gonna ride around because some, some they said there's some amazing riding trails around the lake, I think so. That's what we're gonna do. Last night we did uh, ride a bit in the city thanks to Ali who took us out and uh, showed us around. Um, the Z900 RS, that one, I'm loving it. It feels like home because I'm already riding a Z900 anyway, so this is good. Gonna have some fun today. today we are going to a pop lake like I said earlier and it's going to be a mix of uh, riding through towns and riding through a uh, little off-road not off-road but you know small tiny turny twisty roads and things so it's going to be interesting the thing I don't like about riding here in the US unfortunately is the number of street these traffic lights they terrible it's like every two moments not even two minutes every I don't know, 300 meters you have a traffic light you have a traffic light it's terrible because guys it is hot today uh, it's great as long as we're moving but but when we stop it's hot so I really don't want to stop I want to keep riding just passing through a lot of flat okay I guess Florida is flat there you you can't expect uh, mountain trails and things. Uh, but it's so very well kept. I mean, the grass is mowed and there's plenty of space. Plenty of open space everywhere. It's just a number of traffic signals. It's a pain in the rear end. You find us on the Florida Scenic... Bypassway? I can't remember exactly what it's called. Florida Scenic Byway. That's it. Florida Scenic Byway. And it is gorgeous. I mean, it's a lake-like thing there. Houses, beautiful houses everywhere. And some fantastic roads. Very good asphalt. Nice and twisty. Uh, but only just a two-lane with a Unfortunately, a speed limit of 30. Which unfortunately is really pissing off because this bike handles like a dream. And I love it. And I'd really like to put it through its paces. But hey, the law is the law and we've got to follow it. riding through now has a lot of ranches 
I mean, hell, we can see horses, you know, in uh, not really stables, but it's just out grazing, and uh, houses are fantastic. I mean, they must cost a fortune. Jeez, with even elaborate uh, post boxes and everything. It's an area called Mount Dora. That's where we are now. And just a glimpse of the lake out there. But yeah, it, it's unbelievable houses here. A lot of them gated, not exactly gated communities, but just communities and a lot of single standalone villas. Do you remember when you were watching Home Alone and you'd see all those, you know, houses in that, that street? Uh, that's kind of what this reminds me of. <laughs> this area is. Because, I mean, we always saw it in the movies. It, oh. Some of them are like this. We're riding around the lake. And, I mean, it's right here. Right up pretty much on the water's edge. This road is Lakeshore Drive. And, oh my God. It is gorgeous. And these houses are literally on the lake. So, I can only assume that these boat uh, mooring points belong to these people. Because, wow. I mean, it's literally water's edge. And I'm pretty sure there's crocs in this water. Or alligators. Sorry. Gators. Right here, there be gators. Uh, keeping our eyes peeled for alligators. Did see a weird looking bird and stuff. But yeah. Wow. This is cool. Folks, and we are at Lake Eustace Grill. Now, this place is just by the lake. And uh, although we're sitting inside because it's blisteringly hot, you can sit outside and it's fantastic. Uh, the view is unbelievable. Um, check this out. This is the view from the tables at Lake Eustace Grill. And it's marvelous. So if I ever come to Orlando in winter and decide to do a ride, I would love to come and sit out here and have a meal because the view is fantastic. I mean, wouldn't you want to sit here too? Amazing. <coughs> Lunch is here. And um, we didn't know what we wanted to get. Uh, and uh, funny enough, I wanted one thing and, and she wanted one thing and it ended up being the two things that we were confused about getting in the first place. So, uh, we actually got And then we split them. See? So we got half and half. See? Half and half. <laughs> and she's filming me. Filming you. That's how we're doing. <laughs> 